here are massive, massive steps. Like, no, it's impossible, pretty much. We have to turn around. Oh, Lovey's down. Good morning, world. Welcome back to the channel. It's day number nine on the Trans Euro Trail, riding all the way from the south of England through Wales to the border of Scotland. <laughs> And we're here in Tintin, but it's not the day after the last episode. We've actually taken a few weeks off to do some editing, have a little rest. And also I reapplied for my Indian visa and it got approved. Yes! yes. <laughs> so by the end of the year, we will be heading to India, which is absolutely exciting. I have no idea what went wrong on the first application, but we just redid it, did another e-visa, yes. changed some of the answers and yeah. hey <laughs> here presto, we go. you have a visa. But India can wait for now because we have a lot of trail to do, so let me show you guys what's coming up on this leg of the trail. So we are here and it is now time for the Welsh leg of our Trans-Euro Trail adventure. So we will start by following the trail west until we reach the town of Neath. There we're going to be turning north and heading through the vast wild area of Mid Wales before reaching the Snowdonia National Park up in this area. There we're going to be turning east and heading back towards the border to England which is around here. In the last episode we just crossed the border literally over here and arrived in Wales so now it's time to start exploring Wales. But guys we have a surprise for you. Guess who is joining us for the next few days? <laughs> yeah. It's like it wasn't planned at all. <laughs> Ta-da! It's Robert, the star mechanic. Hello, everybody. Where's the tea? Where's the cups of tea? <laughs> Robert's going to be joining us on this next section of the trail for the next couple of days. And Rob is here on his Yamaha WR250R. You're looking way more off-road capable than we are. But anyway, only time will tell and I'm ready to start this trail. Yes, it's already 10.40, so better hit the road. Let's go. Oh no, hit the trails. Okie dokie, are we ready to start? I'm excited. There it is again, Tintin Abbey. Beautiful. What a place, eh? Beautiful place to visit. And from what I can see, the trail actually starts directly on the opposite side of this road. It's literally right here and up this little lane. And I can see on the map that the lane turns very quickly into a unpaved road. I think we're going to be jumping in at the deep end. Uh oh. Oh, there's a cattle grid. Oopla. That's going to be the trail right there. Yes. We've had a little break, but break time's over. It's time to do the whale section of the Trans Euro Trail. Let's go. Yay! Rob said it's rocky road time. <laughs> oh my god, hold on a minute. Straight through the middle? Yeah, there's quite a lot of big rocks around here, so just be careful, guys. Okay. You don't want to hit one of those the wrong way. And there are some, like, steps, but I think they're manageable. Okay. How beautiful again, hey? It's just so nice, like, this little trails here. Nice, but... Oh, wait, pretty technical to be honest. Whoa, that's a big step here. <laughs> Look at that, just in five seconds, you're just in the middle of a forest, in the middle of nowhere, far away from the cars already. Wow, how incredible. I definitely felt one whack from a rock, but hopefully it hit the bash plate. Anyway, it does look like we're in the valley, which is nice, because I was worried that we were just going to be sent straight up one of these hills. <sighs> All right. Let's do it. Wow, look how rocky it is. <laughs> anyway, we'll stand up a little bit. You won't be able to stand up here, I can tell you that. <laughs> oh no! Oh my god! <laughs> Whoa, okay, okay. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> oh my lord. Okay, yep. I can see. This one looks a little bit technical here. Come on, Ewan. Oh, stalled my bike. 
Oh, was that your first stall of the day? Yeah, it was actually. Uh, I'm a little bit... Uh, oh. Everything's a little bit damp on these rocks as well. Whoa. Okay. This one here is quite rocky. This bit. Boom. Boom, boom. Boom. Hey, wait, I'm still on the road and not in the bush. What a start, hey? What a start. What a start, hey? Guys, it looks like we're going up a hill and it's pretty rocky hill. Oh, Jesus. Oh, oh man. That's pretty crazy. Uh, uh, very, very bad conditions. Like, it's just really super rocky, and like, the rocks are quite slippery. Hmm. <sighs> Let me see on the map how far it is to the end of this section. Wait a second. Oh, there's the road, okay. So it's going for around 500 meters or so to the road. It doesn't look like it's going on for miles, so I reckon let's just try to do the 500 meters. This section here, I'm going to have to sort of definitely use my legs and just paddle my way up. Oh, Jesus. Jesus, hold on. Oh. oh yeah, I can't get up this, guys. I really can't get up. Should I come and help you? Should we just push the bike up this bit? I can see the top of the hill is only like just there. I mean, it's just ridiculously rocky. That's. We're coming to rescue you. Oh, <laughs> Robert stole it. I'm not the only one. <laughs> <laughs> Stole it. <laughs> okay. So now wait, I have to find a um, place where I can stop. Oh no, the rain just started! So... I will just check it out here quickly, yeah? Well, actually guys, it's not possible. It's definitely 100% not possible. Because here are massive, massive steps. Like, no, it's impossible, pretty much. We have to turn around. Yeah, you can see for yourself, but this we definitely can't do. No, there is no, absolutely no chance. Have a look. I want that you see that. <laughs> I want you to see that, seriously. I mean, this is like, I don't think that I'm going up here. <laughs> the steps here are ridiculous. If you go here, there we would be stuck. If you go here, there's no chance we can push up the bikes up here. Look at this step. Look. Exactly. It looks so nice here, but seriously, I think we have to, um, we really have to surrender at this point. Yeah, so what we can do is just go back, join the road just there, and just yeah. take the trail on the other side of this. Oh, yeah, it's sad, but uh, just sit on this step, my love, for a second, just to see like how high these steps are. Yeah, it goes, the step goes up to my, nearly up to my knee. Um, and our clearance is like, like there. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, now we have to turn around. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, look, we're in the Welsh rainforest. <laughs> 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 Gotta push it backwards. 
Yeah, just have to wait until we're trying to put it away the storm here. Put it away then. This is so hard to turn around. Oh. <laughs> okay, we are nearly, we're sort of, sort of some of the way there. Hold that for a minute. Okay. Look at the size of this log. Okay. Be careful. Slippery. Oh yeah, these rocks are slippery now. Okay, hold the bike. Yeah. Just gonna move out some of these. Yeah. Oh. Okay, ready? Yeah. Oh, Wait. Come on. Okay, yep. Yeah. It's nearly there. Yep. <laughs> nearly there. Okay. Yep. Wait yep. a second, so we straighten up. Okay. Let me see if I can get my sand down. Okay, that's fine, perfect. Okay. How are you doing, Rob? You you're nearly round. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah, you're pretty much on the straight there now. Oh, we have to go all the way down. <laughs> yeah, and plus it's just rained. So now all the rocks are even wetter than when we were going up. <laughs> oh no. So I'm stuck already? <laughs> oh. No, oh, I'm on the wrong side here as well. I'm where the really big rocks are. Oh man. Oh my god, you just went over the two biggest rocks on the whole road. I know. <laughs> oh, I'm down. I'm okay. down. Okay, alright. Hold on, I'm coming. Sorry, my love. It's okay. Okay, ready? Okay. Yeah. Three, two, one, <coughs> go. <Wait>. Okay. <laughs> All right, I'll hold it steady. Okay. You sit on it. Okay. And then now, now the rocks don't look as bad, so just yeah. try to roll down and pick the best line. Okay. 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 Jesus, what a start to the morning, hey? Crazy man. <laughs> because for some reason I'm always like going to where like sort of the biggest rocks are. <laughs> well, yep. Sort of. Oh no, shouldn't have stopped. <laughs> I don't know how to get over this lock here. <sighs> I'm coming. Yeah, I mean, if I go over there, I'll definitely slide. <laughs> I'm going down the hill. Going down the hill. Very, very wet hill. Oh, yeah, you see? A little bit of a slide, hey? Yeah. Oh, you are sliding a bit. Go down there, that's where I went. That was easier. That's it. And uh, that's it. Um, yep. Yep. That's it. Mm -mm. I'm going to try to pull you over as well. Ready? Go. Oh, sliding a bit. Oh, I'm in a really, really bad position here. Oh, oh bugger. I'm going Should I pu here. push you back? Yep, let's go back. I'm, I'm heading towards the bloody river. Three, two, one, go. Three, two, one, go. Yep. Three, two, one, go. Three, two, one, go. Three, two, one, go. Three, two, one, go. Now I'm like so parallel with the log. That's my yeah, problem. Yeah, exactly. And I need to be not parallel with the log. Yeah. Let me see if I can move my back tie around. Uh, let's put a rock. Put, put, put a few more. There's quite a big one over there. If you put a little pile of rocks there, I'll try to use that as leverage. See if that's enough to get round it.
Yeah. <laughs> if I get straight to if I get straight to the log like that, then it's easier. Hey Rob, you're back on the mesh. You you went out of range. Oh yeah. There we go, we made it down. So there we go, one hour later, and we're back at Tintin Abbey, everyone. So it's now quarter to 12. Time for lunch. <laughs> so we're gonna pick up the trail uh, a few miles down the road on the other side of that hell hole. Let's start making some distance. So we just came into the town of Chepstow and look at this lovely gate, look at that. We're not going through it unfortunately, that's not our way. But we just came here to fuel up, ready for some miles on the trail. Plus we had to get out of the rain for a little bit. It was probably nearly an hour solid of rain. But the forecast says that that's it for today. So hopefully the rain's gonna stay away and we can actually get some miles done. Oh, I think we're going on this little thing. Let's see how this is. Okay. It looks a little bit rubbly, to be honest. Hold on a second. Wait. Oh, Jesus. It looks like they, at one point, may have tarmacked this. Yeah, wait. Oh. Yeah, I'm across. There's a bit of a tree here. Rob, your bike is low enough for this tree. Can you get under that? Oh my God, yeah, this is definitely. Okay, yep. I just to power on. <laughs> That's narrow, isn't it? My helmet's fogging up. I got too much water in it. <sighs> Bloody hell. Bloody hell, Harry. That's quite thin here. I'm just going nice and easy, nice and slow. I practice now to go straight. Okay. Oh, goes into a little bit of a farmy track here. Yeah, I think we just stay on the edge here. This is a funny place for a green lane, isn't it? Oh, that's nice. I like it. Just be careful you don't slide here. Why? A bit of a like a sideward slope. Woo! Nice. After the first lane today, I was a bit worried that yeah. everything would be like that. Yeah, me too. So I'm kind of happy to see this. Yeah, me too. Oh, this bit's nice. Very nice. Holy crap! Did you see Are that? You Are you down? Oh my goodness. Wait a second. Oh, Lavi's down. Lavi's down. That is exactly the same bit, Lavi, that I slipped on. There was like quite, quite a slip though. That was like a little bit like unexpected, you know, like I was going not too slow. I was going quite fast, but okay. Are you ready? Three, two, one. Okay. Wait a second. It's caught in my jacket. Okay. Yep. You're up. Oh yeah. Look, you really like tore out the ground there a bit, didn't you? Wow. Look at that. Your foot peg might be maybe bent. Is your foot peg bent? I think it's fine. You just picked up quite a lot of the uh, the field. <laughs> you okay, my love? Yes, yeah, okay. Oh, it's a bit of a slide, hey? Yes. Yeah, I did exactly the same thing just before you did it. 
like that, Shh, my back wheel ever, all over the place. Guys, we hit another trail here in the beautiful countryside of Wales. <laughs> and the trail is ridiculous. It's a little bit overgrown, hey? Isn't it? Oh, who nearly fell there. <laughs> oh. Whoa, I mean, this one here is so overgrown. Oh my god. Oh, oh god. No, I can't do that. Is it? And then just down, round the side and then come into the right after. Not that far to the left, my love. You've gone in the bush. <laughs> <laughs> You've gone too far left. <laughs> oh, stalled it. Yes. <laughs> Made it! <laughs> Sorry, I have to film this. <laughs> I'm in the bush. I didn't drop it though, but I am definitely riding through a bush here. <laughs> Oh no! Are you? Rob is stuck in the bush! <laughs> oh no, he is! <laughs> okay, wait, 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 I pull you out! Oh, wait, I can't stop here. Wait a second. Yeah, just, just rest a second. I just have to try to... Um, try to... Wait... Ollie? <laughs> can you come? Rob is really in the bush. <laughs> he, he's like really in the bush. And the thing is, I can't get my bloody stand down anywhere here. So you have to come and rescue us. Oh, you are in a bush. But your front wheel is in that rut and the back wheel is in that rut. Okay. Okay, ready? Three, two, one. Three, two, one. Three, two, one. Three, three, two, one. Okay, one more. Do you reckon you can get out or shall I? Okay. Let me let me push you, shall I? Yep, I think you're gonna get in the rut now. There we go. Oh man. What are we doing? What are we doing here, hey? That's it. Ah, there you go. That's it. That's the end. It's a very, very deep rut. Oh my god, I'm scared. Rob, you do the lunch vlog. Um, yeah. uh, is, it, is it recording now? It's recording right now. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> That's me, I'm spent. <laughs> We're doing the lunch break and I'm spent already. Nearly died. Heart attack, God knows what. You're doing great, Rob. <laughs> I'm not sure where we are. <laughs> 
all, oh. I, all I can see is the sun over there <laughs> in my eyes. I think we've all nearly died a few times <laughs> on this trail so far. I don't know whether you can see this lot about this lot who have taken the opportunity to lie, to lie down and die next to me. <laughs> Let's all just die here on the side of the road in Wales. <laughs> it's been fun. We've all had problems getting through the lanes. Yes. But we are here. Yes. So far, so good. Mm. Yeah, we just had the one turn back this morning that was just absolutely ridiculous. Since then, we've powered through everything that the trail has thrown at us we have encountered some pretty difficult trails that's a certain fact oh yeah so i think it's time for some oreos some crackers some cheese <laughs> some a little bit of bread hovis soft white yeah bread and cheese bread and cheese <laughs> is that it can we finish now yeah We're not having a lunch break in there then. Nice. Everybody's back on the bike. We can continue the trails, eh? <laughs> we did arrive at another crazy little cut through. Oh. Oh my God, where did you go? Up the rock here or what? Okay, yeah, I went through it. <laughs> Where do we have to go? Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. I, I don't know if I will be able to do that. I don't like that. <laughs> I did it! <laughs> You're through? Perfect, perfect. Bloody hell. That looks very rutty. I mean, how, how did you go through here? God. Yeah, but that wasn't very nice. I must say, yes. <laughs> Sorry. You! Up, up, not in the bush this time, please. Going to the right. <gasps> oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Rob. Okay. Three, two, one. <laughs> I can't believe I fell off on the bloody road. <laughs> Coming through the nice little Welsh town of Usk. Look at these beautiful little buildings. Whoa, that house there said it was built in 1550. Look, the Usk Rural Life Museum. This village has been here for a while. Here we're going over the river Usk. Look at that. Nice. So we actually had enough today of the green lanes and Ollie just called up a, a bunch of campsites and we found actually a quite cool campsite not too far away from here yeah the first five places I called were completely booked so I think it's a pretty popular area for camping apparently but anyway this place said they could do us um, a pitch and 10 pounds per person so 30 pounds for the three of us which is not too bad 
But yeah, it's definitely time to head off trail and have a bit of a rest because this day started off pretty crazy and then didn't really let up. No, I mean, every track was actually pretty crazy. Like, they were all quite difficult, let's say. But every time we went down a new track, I was like thinking, oh yeah, this one will be the one, this will be fine, this will be fine. And then there's always at least one part of every single trail we've been on today, which has been like, you kind of just stop in front of it and you're like, what is going on? So anyway, this campsite is 10 miles away, 25 minutes. So we're going to head there now, have a good rest, because it's been a crazy first day on trail. Oh, yes. There we go. That's our hotel for the night. Questy Hotel, five star. <laughs> Rob said that sounds like me. No guys, we have a field to camp in, all right? Okay, this is the place on the right. Crimsaw camping, there we go. So the forecast said no rain, but here we are, and it's raining. But it's really exciting because Rob's making us all a hot chocolate. Yeah, Eggs <laughs> Army hot chocolate. An ex-army hot chocolate. If it's good enough for NATO, then it's good enough for me. Great buy if you're going away. Nice. I'm excited. That's great. And Lavi is doing good on the food front. Look at this. What have you got here? Crackers and cheese. Whoa. Then we will have pasta with a nice bolognese from Germany, actually. Yeah? Mit feinstem Fleisch. It's like with the finest meat. <laughs> Because Rob's just got back from a motorcycle trip in Europe and this one you actually got this in Germany? Yeah, I bought it in Garmisch. Nice. And Lavi's managed to rig up sort of this thing above our heads to protect us from the rain. And she's like tied it with our guy ropes to the fence and to Rob's bike. Try not to ride, ride away and rip, it, rip your tent down. <laughs> Which I actually did to my own tent once. <laughs> I was just inspired by Rob's uh, construction here because he's like, I want a canopy. And I'm like, me too. But anyway, it was a tough day on trail. So we're all pretty happy to have a nice rest, have an early night, have a nice pasta. It says again that it shouldn't rain tomorrow, but it said it shouldn't rain now, so I don't know what to believe anymore. Good job, Welsh weather people. <laughs> weather frogs. Weather frogs. You say weather frogs. Do so they use frogs? Yeah. <laughs> no, we don't say weather frogs. Oh. Wow. Look at this meal. I'm really excited. Me too. And that's it from us today. We hope you enjoyed the video. If so, please give us a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. Share the video with your friends and family. Comment below and we will see you next time. Might not see me next time. <laughs> <laughs>